trade, tourism, and the arts converge at Red Wings Mississippi Riverfront, helping to drive the regional and state economy. A variety of infrastructure investments along and near the riverfront are needed to expand interstate commerce, protect users' health and safety, improve the environmental quality, and enhance visitors' experiences. These investments consist of the Red Wing Rivertown Renaissance Project and the Red Wing Regional Public Safety Center. The Mississippi River plays a crucial role in the commercial and cultural life of the region. The Levee Road serves a major grain export terminal and other commercial businesses while providing vehicles and pedestrians riverfront access. The riverfront is also home to two parks and an early 20th century small boat harbor with a unique boathouse village. Two multi-use regional trails, the Cannon Valley Trail and Goodhue Pioneer Trails, beckon recreational visitors. The nearby historic Sheldon Performing Arts Theater draws 60% of its audience from across Minnesota and the neighboring states. These features make Red Wings Riverfront a regional trade center and tourism draw. The Renaissance combines five interrelated construction projects that will help Red Wing fulfill its vision to become one of the premier historic river towns on the Mississippi. This project will reconstruct the levee road, which seasonably floods and poses dangers to pedestrians, bicycle and vehicle traffic year round. Connect the historic downtown to Bay Point Park and to the Cannon Valley and Goodhue Pioneer Trails via the Riverwalk Trail. Rebuild the harbor wall and parking area near the small boat harbor. Build docking facilities at Levee Park to accommodate riverboat traffic and restore the historic Sheldon Performing Arts Theater for 21st century audiences. The $6 million request will leverage local and federal funding of the same amounts. Combining these five projects is an efficient way to share resources and minimize disruption, which in turn save time and money for the city, state, and local citizens. Red Wing lacks the public safety infrastructure of the other similarly sized cities. Red Wing's public safety facilities have an approximate 20 minute response time to the western boundaries of the regional service area, which is home to commercial, industrial, and residential properties of the city, Prairie Island Tribal Community, the Prairie Island Nuclear Generating Station, and the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers Lock and Dam No. 3. Constructing the second regional public safety center and training facility will cut response time to the nuclear facility by 50 percent and improve service to the area. The city is requesting approximately $2.6 million to supplement local funding for the pre-design, final design, and construction of the new regional facility. The historic Red Wing Riverfront area is a state treasure on the Mississippi River. Funding these projects now makes sense because it would leverage other federal, state, and local funds to complete the project in the least disruptive method possible. It's good for Red Wing and good for Minnesota.